So we got this first position similar to how you just did, pull your heels down. I gave him a smaller ball because I actually want him to be able to actually adduct, meaning his knees are closer together in relation to his hips being a little bit wider apart. You could keep the foam roller that you're using right now. Yep, he's gonna lift up his right foot first. We're gonna pull his left heel down. Now I'm gonna go through progression. So the first one is just to reach your arm towards this. Good, and just relax right there. Now give me a good inhale through your nose and a long exhale. Three second holds on each exhale. So his left heel, left hamstring's pulling down, right heel is going up to the ceiling, left hand is reaching. I want him to get his middle finger and the back of this heel as far away from each other as possible by reaching upwards. So what does that mean? Imagine there's a line going all the way there, the back side of his body, all the way up to this hamstring there. We're taking those and getting super far away. Then he's gonna exhale and get all of his air out and hold for three to five seconds. On his inhale, I want him to imagine like his back left rib cage is actually going into the ground as if he's almost turning into the left side as the left reaches away. So he's pulling that back to reach more with the shoulder blade. Beautiful. Now, as a progression, you can actually lift your head. Okay, so lift the head. Good, and it's almost now we're doing just a slight little crunch, but it's all coming as these go longer, as that left hamstring comes. And you should feel a ton of these abs right here on your exhales. Close that thing up with a long exhale. Keep holding, I'm gonna give you 15 more seconds, then we're gonna switch sides. So we're working the ability to stabilize across your body, putting something on one direction, something going the opposite, okay? So slowly put that down, get yourself even, head relaxes, pull down. If you started feeling like your neck was going crazy and you lost the hamstring, you lost all these other things that we're, we're talking about, all 70 million of them, try to relax and put your head back down and you can even use a pillow here, okay? So that goes up, pull that right heel down, good. Left heel's going up to the ceiling, we're reaching across with the right. Again, imagine that from here all the way down through his back left side, all the way across here, all of this is getting as long as possible stretching. You can have your hand here or here, wherever it's comfortable. Just think that you're reaching towards this toe right there. Good, whenever you feel ready, you can keep your head up or you can keep it down and you have the pillow option. Way longer exhales and inhales are important here, okay? We're looking for expansion in this class. So even though I'm constantly never shut up about exhale all the way, hold, show me ninja-like smooth inhale, and show me that it can fill up all the areas that we wanted to get to right now. Good, as a position is built in for you, but you still need to focus on the inhale. Don't even worry about where it goes if you, if you don't need to. Five, four, three, two, and one, good job, okay. 